earlier I was running the machine and I noticed that the uh, one side of the machine was running a little slower than the other side um, and I noticed that if you put both uh, levers completely forward it would want to track to the left uh, a little bit um, one side was running a little faster than the other side um, and is there any, any tips or anything we can look for as far as what to look for if um, you know, if we want to fix our own machine, try to get it running right. Yeah, well that's really important if you own a machine or looking to buy one. If it's driving a little bit slow on one side, that's your first indication if you have a pump or motor going out. So you want to treat that with some respect because it could become very expensive. Uh, so Pete mentioned the left side was a little slow and forward. I had previously drove the machine and I noticed that too but in reverse it was still okay so I had a reasonable assurance that the pump or the motor the expensive stuff wasn't the problem so I could feel good about buying the machine um, to better explain that if you have a drive pump go out it shows up both in forward and reverse there's a half a percent chance you get the wild card that only shows up in one direction but it I'm gonna say it never happens that's a general statement not an absolute statement but it never happens that it's only one direction it's either forward or reverse if you got a bad pump or motor uh, that's not an absolute statement but it works most of the time so what we're looking for is why is it driving slow and forward on the left side and we're checking the steering linkages you see see those linkages move a little bit uh, we see this bushing being bad here but that just makes it uh, hard to adjust the centering that doesn't make it bad it's just a little maintenance thing again you'll see that bushing worn right there that makes it hard to adjust your neutral it doesn't make it actually drive slow. Uh, <clears throat> one of the things that will make it drive slow is loose engine mounts because what happens when you pull this forward if the engine mounts aren't tightened and the pumps fastened to the engine then the pump moves forward with it and it's the same as not pushing your lever all the way forward if the pumps moving forward part of the way. Uh, you, there you actually see the pump move a little bit and yeah you kind of if you bounce it there is a problem there the problem right there is very hard to see on the camera but on the rear of the pump right here there's supposed to be a bolt right in here where my finger is it's missing we get a lot of pumps in where the bolts broke off so there's a possibility that the pump housing is stripped out which can be kind of a major issue because you're, if the housing's stripped out, you still need a new pump. So that's something that might bite me a little bit because I didn't check that before I bought it. <coughs> that, I'd say, is the problem if the right side was driving slow, but there, it's not. It's actually the left side driving slow. So all these linkages in here, um, you see how far I'm moving the lever before the pump, the pump, lever on the pump isn't moving, but the lever on the machine is. So that's the addition of a little wear and the bushings there and here and here they're only a couple bucks a piece every time i get a machine i just go in there and change all of them because it makes it drive so much nicer but what we see here you see this see that lever is bottoming out on the pump before it bottoms out in the frame here the other one doesn't the other one bottoms out in the frame first and you see you see it bottoming out uh, on the pump backwards before it bottoms out in the frame. So what we want to do to fix the specific problem Pete asked about is loosen these bolts and shorten that linkage and tighten the bolts so that when you move the lever forward it pulls the pump lever farther forward and the machine is going to drive farther on the left and Presuming the right side is driving at full speed once we get the left side also driving at full speed It'll drive straight. So that is a simple steering linkage adjustment in this situation however in looking for that we did find a potential stripped pump housing because of the missing bolt in there now maybe it's just missing 
maybe we get lucky and just put a bolt in, but if you're evaluating a machine, just know that's a common problem when that, that bolt will break off when it comes loose rather than fall out, and it'll strip the threads when it breaks off. 